हेलो एवरीबॉडी आई एम सोमो गंतिगिरी वेलकम टू माय चैनल्स टुडे आई विल वी विल डिस्कस हाउ टू प्रिपेयर और हाउ टू स्टडी मेडिसिनल केमिस्ट्री फॉर जीपैट सो टुडे वन ऑफ माय फ्रेंड मिस्टर शुभम रॉय हैव जॉइंड विद अस हैज जॉइंड विद अस ही हैज डन एम फॉर्म फ्रॉम जामिया हमदर्द यूनिवर्सिटी इन फार्मास्यूटिकल केमिस्ट्री एंड ही इज ऑल इंडिया रैंक वॉच थ्री इन जी एंड ही इज करेंटली एक्टिंग एज एज एन असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर Uh, of BMS College of uh, BBS Institute of Pharmaceutical and Allied Sciences, Greater Noida. Okay, so welcome, Subham. Today we want to discuss how to prepare medicinal chemistry for GPAT. So tell me something about the preparation process of medicinal chemistry for GPAT. Okay. Uh, so first of all, uh, thank you, Subham, for inviting me in your channel. Uh, uh, so. Uh, What is your first question? First question is how to prepare notes or how to prepare the subject medicinal chemistry for GP. Okay. Actually, uh, for medicinal chemistry, the uh, first thing is practice. Okay? okay. So the more you will practice uh, those structure in your uh, copy, the more you can remember those things. Okay. And another thing is you need to correlate the structure with nomenclature. Okay. okay. So you need to uh, understand that uh, what is the scaffold uh, of a structure and uh, what are those functional group and uh, at which position they are attached. Okay. okay. So until then, unless you are not visualizing those structure with the uh, help of nomenclature, okay. so you can remember it. So uh, practice more and more. Okay. So this is the one and only solution to remember uh, medicinal chemistry. Okay. Okay. I think the most important portion of medicinal chemistry is a uh, structure, synthesis, and sir. These these three. Yeah. See, uh, see, there are uh, some parts like um, the classification of drugs huh. and the mechanism of action uh, of drugs. So those are uh, common with pharmacology. If you are uh, if you are strong in pharmacology, then you are already done with those parts. Okay. So the uh, then comes into the SAR and the structure activity. relationship and the synthesis of a drug and the nomenclature of a drug so for uh, for those things you need to have some uh, uh, adequate knowledge about organic chemistry organic chemistry okay 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 so uh, so i think if your uh, concept of organic chemistry is strong and your uh, pharmacology is also strong then uh, medicinal chemistry will be a, a bonus subject for you okay you don't need to bother about it Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. This is a very good point. And uh, then, uh, uh, can you mention some very some good books on uh, medicinal chemistry? Uh, I think the easiest book is uh, Sri Ram Yoga Story. Okay. And and if you want to uh, study in high level, then you can uh, follow uh, Wilson Griswold or Poes. Okay. Uh. Okay. Then uh, these are the key books. Okay. These are the. There are also one book which is uh, uh, Alagarsham. Alagarsham. Okay. 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 Yeah. Yeah. We can okay. also these follow these. These are the. These are the reference books. Yeah. Those are the. These are the reference or textbooks yes, yes. for medicinal chemistry. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Then the next question is: Can you mention some important topics from medicinal chemistry for GPAT? Uh, see, this very uh, uh, tricky question because. in jpat uh, they can ask question from uh, any topics okay. uh, from any topics but uh, i think uh, uh, the the chapter cns they frequently ask question from a uh, cns drug and cns related drug and a cns related drug and okay. the thing is nomenclature you need to have uh, a good concept about nomenclature especially the heterocyclic compound heterocyclic. and their nomenclature because most of these drugs are hetero heterocyclic in nature okay okay so the heterocyclic compound you should have a uh, clear knowledge about those uh, those chapter okay 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 the nomenclature the structure of the heterocyclic <coughs> compounds they are yeah, yeah, those yeah. are very good uh, yeah, yeah it is very okay. important very important sorry those are very important yes, okay so then the next question is which is more important organic chemistry or medicinal chemistry for gpat uh see uh, if you don't have any uh, concept about uh, any knowledge about organic chemistry okay. and uh, if, if if you are dreaming that you want to uh, solve each and every question of medicinal chemistry for gpat then you are in wrong place okay, okay. so you have to start with organic chemistry okay. and 
and you will end up with male chemistry okay okay can you can you make so that, that reverse way is not possible reverse i mean the reverse way is not possible reverse. you have to start with organic chemistry and your uh, if your pharmacology is strong then medicinal chemistry will be a bonus subject for you okay 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 so uh, can you mention some good books on uh, organic chemistry i think morrison board is uh, yeah. enough Morrison um, Biod is enough, yeah. Finer Morrison Biod is, is enough. You can. Finer is also there. Yeah, Morrison Biod, Finer is also there. Is Those two books are uh, very uh, common for uh, uh, pharma students. All pharma students. Then uh, coming to the next question, can anyone crack GPAD without? There are, uh, there are, there are also uh, one very famous book which is Clearden. Okay. 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 So you can also follow this. Yeah. Okay, they also can follow this. Okay, can you? Uh, the next question is: Can anyone crack GPAD without attempting a single question from medicinal chemistry? Is it possible? Yes, it is possible. I have so many friends who uh, who never study anything from medicinal chemistry, but uh, still they have qualified GPAD with a uh, good rank. So it is possible. But I will suggest that at least uh, make some concept about organic chemistry. Okay. okay. at least try to make some concept about organic chemistry uh, then i don't think medicinal chemistry would be uh, a problem for you okay but it is possible medicinal chemistry it is possible okay so uh, this is uh, this was the question and uh, then coming to the next question can you mention some important points or important sars okay uh, or important synthesis from medicinal chemistry for gpat there are uh, so many uh, acr are there like most of the acrs from uh, cns compound like barbiturate or barbiturate benzodiazepine uh, yeah. these are benzodiazepine barbiturate these are, these, are, are, these are very common there are so many uh, you, you have to make a list about it make okay make a list about it so uh, yeah you have to make a list about it i think i have not prepared any list right now Okay, okay. But no issues. Prepare, yeah. No issues. But there are some common, very common and very, uh, very, very frequently asked questions on uh, tetracycline, on benzodiazepines, yeah, yeah. barbiturates, thiazide diuretics. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Are, these Obviously. These are very important and very common. So. Yes, yes, yes. So, so um, this is the end of our video. Okay. Hope all of you like the video. Subham, also thank you for joining us. Okay. So this is the end. Okay, of the all of you subscribe to uh, Somo's uh, channel. Okay. And please like this video and okay. share this video. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you.